Hello. So the intent is to give a demonstration of how we manage to record a screencast on uh, an Ubuntu desktop. Uh, so we have this laptop equipped with a HDMI, HDMI output. This is important because we connect to it uh, this Wacom graphic tablet. So the tablet comes with a, a stylus. Uh, this tablet displays a screen uh, through HDMI, HDMI output, which allows to uh, draw. Uh, maybe you can look at uh, my stylus, which moves uh, the cursor. Okay, so I can annotate uh, quite easily documents in the journal provided that uh, calibration is okay. So uh, I'm fortunate in Ubuntu because calibration looks uh, quite good uh, without further configuration. So uh, here I'm uh, capturing the video of um, uh, this uh, webcam, external webcam. So as you can see, um, I have this uh, tablet and I'm going to use a uh, vocal screen to try and... Uh, okay, I've lost my mouse. Uh, yeah, I'm going to try to use vocal screen. Oh, give it to me. Yeah, it's a bit hard. So, uh, vocal screen is here. So, vocal screen... Um, Come on to the capture area, yeah. So the, oh yeah, it's in French, of course. Anyway, so the goal is to capture a particular zone. Um, it can display uh, the laptop's uh, webcam. So here you can see this new video of me. And I'm gonna use uh, Xonol. So maybe I can put that down. Yeah, I have a microphone too. Uh, so the microphone is uh, uh, supposedly of better quality than what I'm using um, usually, which is the embedded uh, microphone from the laptop. So anyway, um, yeah, I want to use uh, Xonol. So Xonol. Uh, opens up and um, I'm gonna move it around. Uh, the goal is to annotate uh, some PDF. Um, so I'm selecting uh, this PDF file. I'm gonna set uh, the, okay, the display uh, for one page. I'm, um, so I'm going to capture the zone of the screen with a uh, vocal screen. So where are you, vocal screen? Uh, I need you. Uh, yeah. Oh, come on. Where are you? I'm chuckling with the windows. Uh, yeah, come on here. Uh, you can go there and uh, you are uh, here. So I'm going to capture a zone. So you can see those... Um, sliders so um, let's say this is uh, out so you, you see this uh, blue zone so I am gonna try to put um, Xonol in full screen so once that's done I will resize uh, to the height of the page. So here I have my PDF file displayed here. So I'm adjusting the capture area of vocal screen to adjust the display of the PDF. I will move uh, the webcam here uh, to try and remove the borders yeah so let's say that uh, now I have this area 
which is 1,100 by 77, 770, um, which is good because the resolution of the PDF is quite good. Uh, if you are doing so, my screen captures are okay. Uh, it will record in a uh, high res and uh, going to be quite good, hopefully. So once this is done, I need to uh, yeah, configure a bit more. Uh, oh, come on, where is it? Below. Uh, yeah, I need to configure a bit more. So uh, the sound, I'm going to capture on um, my microphone, external microphone instead of the internal one of the laptop. I can say that I want uh, five seconds of a countdown um, before it starts. And yeah, the rest is, uh, well, I, I could just adapt the frame rate, but uh, I think um, for a start, I'm going to use 25 uh, frames per second. And um, I guess uh, it's okay if I'm moving back uh, so normal in front screen. And I'm going to start the recording um, of um, uh, of uh, Voco screen. So Voco screen, uh, here it is. No, is it recording? Oh, I need to, come on. Where is it? Uh, I need to start it. Okay. Now we are recording. I'm putting Xonol in the front. I now can go back to the first page and pretend I am um, uh, recording a real presentation. So I would like to get back to the uh, preview of my webcam so that you can see what's happening uh, in the back. So. Um, so here you see I'm uh, uh, with the stylus and I can, of course, oh, <laughs> of course we lost it. Uh, come on, uh, I want you on the front. Is it possible? Toujours au premier plan, always on front. Yeah, so I guess now I can, yeah. So I can click, as you can see, I can uh, select uh, uh, another tool and I can just highlight an area. So yeah, that, that, that works uh, as expected. Um, so yeah, so now I have configured uh, the buttons also uh, in Ubuntu parameters to be able to uh, move uh, up and down through the PDF slides. So the microphone is not far away. Uh, the gain is uh, configured and uh, hopefully um, everything is set. So I can now um, uh, move on with the, with the slideshow. Uh, this is it. So now I'm uh, gonna stop uh, the Voco screen recording yeah. and um, it's done so I have uh, my files um, here and uh, um, videos and here we have the latest uh, recording which works Let's try and uh, um, remove focal screen from here. Uh, I'm chuckling, it's too much. Uh, come on, I don't want anymore to see this video in the front. Yeah, so let's kill this. Yeah, okay. I'm uh, minimizing the uh, zonal now. Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay, so the video. Uh, as you can see, yeah, this is no longer useful. Um, so the video is uh, 
uh, now um, the, the, the zone that uh, I captured uh, with the overlay of the preview of the webcam and uh, and if I play it so you can't probably hear the sound but uh, I'm hearing it yeah so um, this uh, this works uh, of course I can pop up uh, uh, some tools if I want to make a demo but uh, basically uh, there would uh, only be um, what is inside the, the capture area of vocal screen and of course the annotations with the stylus are working um, yeah so that's uh, that's pretty cool the resolution is good and um, yeah I just have to upload it to YouTube or somewhere else I guess um, I'll close here and uh, provide a, a written documentation for more details